Hey everybody, so this is not the usual video that I normally do. Today I'm just going to be looking at some food that I ordered on Uber Eats. Since I order a lot of food on Uber Eats, I thought it'd be kind of fun to start making some videos where we, you know, review them and talk about them and see how you guys might like them if you decided to try it yourself. Alright, so today I ordered from a place called Chung Chun Rice Hot Dogs. They're Korean hot dogs that my friend just told me about last night. And I love hot dogs and hamburgers, so let's give this a shot. Alright, so this is the box that the uh, hot dogs came in. Let's open it up and let's see how it looks. I'll just try and do this with one hand here. Ooh, look at that. So, I ordered three different hot dogs. So one is the ramen noodle one. That looks like it's this one here. One is the double cheese. That should be this one here, and one is the Jumbo, and it makes sense because it's the biggest one. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to cut it open and let's have a look at what's on the inside. Alright, I have my fork and knife, let's cut this open. So, this one should be the double cheese here. Ooh, it's crunchy sounding. Let's have a look. Come on. Okay, so this is the double cheese on the inside here. It's an awkward angle trying to cut this with the camera in front, so this isn't looking the nicest, but uh, hey, first video, right? So, this is the double cheese on the inside. Let's see if I can get this to focus here. Get some lighting on here. Yeah, so that's what that looks like. Let's go down to the other one here, which is the jumbo. So this is the jumbo, so focus on that. Is it focusing? Yeah, so this is the jumbo. It's got like, uh, let's see if I can zoom in a little. There we go. Yeah, so it's a pretty big sausage inside there. Give that a bite after, just right now cutting through all these to see how they look on the inside. And let's do this last one over here now, which is the noodle one. So one thing to note is that the skin of all of these hot dogs, meaning the outside here, is really crunchy. I don't know if you can hear it as I'm trying to cut through these, but uh, nice crunchy outside. I wouldn't be surprised if these were fried. Okay, so let's have a look at this one here. So this is the noodle one. Looking pretty good. Yeah, all right. Whoops, probably should have taken a picture for the thumbnail, but um, oh well, I'm just gonna have to eat, <laughs> take a picture like this and I'm gonna test them out. Okay, cool. So, time for the taste test. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of this now has kind of fell over onto my desk here, but you know what, let's, let's, let's give it a shot anyway. So the first one that we're gonna try is the the ramen noodle one with the outside crispy kind of skin. It's looking pretty good. Hmm. Definitely really crunchy. Um, they definitely have some sort of the paste that they're using on the outside or the skin that they're using on the outside. It looks like it would be on a corn dog, but it's definitely very different. They use some sort of different uh, flour or something like that. It's, it's good. It's good. Now, 
The hot dog on the inside tastes pretty standard, like any sort of hot dog that you would get anywhere else. So <clears throat> I wouldn't necessarily be looking at that as the main attraction here. The main attraction is going to be the outside, that crispy skin that they have on there. Um, and when you look on the app, you can actually add different sort of things on top of that. So you can add potatoes, you can add uh, different sort of things that I'm, I'm guessing this is just a dough that they then kind of <clears throat> take this and roll the hot dog in before it gets fried. So I didn't add on anything other um, than what these came with because I just wanted to try them naturally first and then after, you know, if I decide that I like this, I can go back and order more. So this is the jumbo. Let's try this one out. <clears throat> now the outside pastry is actually kind of growing on me here because it's it's pretty soft um so it's crunchy on the outside but when you bite into it it's pretty soft it kind of you know um it's not going to be exactly the same but it reminds me of like a brioche sort of bun when you bite into a brioche it's flaky and crispy on the outside and then you bite into it it's like a little bit soft and chewy on the inside so yeah that's what that reminds me of all right, and let's try this double cheese. So I'm a little bummed out about the double cheese because in the picture, it looks like there's a sausage on the inside. Um, and that might just be my bad. Maybe I assume that this hole here from the picture is a sausage, but it's not. So this is literally just cheese on a stick, rolled into this pastry and then fried. This is actually pretty good. It's not the most healthy thing for sure. I mean, if you're ordering this, it's not, you're not here to, to lose weight, but <clears throat> I think every now and again, it's good to try out new things. Personally, I've been working out a lot. Um, not so much now that the gyms are closed for the, because of, uh, because of the, um, you know, things are closing down, but I lost quite a bit of weight. So, you know, might as well try some some of this stuff out, gain a couple extra pounds for for January, and then I'll work it off once the gyms open up again. But yeah, I mean, that's the three uh, hot dogs that are tried here from the Korean uh, hot dog place locally here in Vancouver. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. Is this something that you want to try yourself? Is this something that uh, you guys would, uh, or maybe you've already been there and you have a better recommendation than the three that I got? So personally, I'd probably order from here again um, not as a meal substitute, but maybe like on a Friday night or something like that, or a Saturday night when I'm feeling, you know, I want to play some video games and just want to chill and watch a movie, probably something like that. But uh, yeah, let me know guys. Uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up um, and let me know because I can make more of these. I order from Uber Eats at least once a week, sometimes twice a week, just depending on my mood. So if you like these kinds of videos, I can definitely make a lot more. All right, everybody, that's all for today. Peace.